Hey, what's up guys? It's Safan Around and my name is Jordan. This is a channel where the episodes come out the day before the lines drop and I'm filming a little bit earlier in the day so you might hear some kids playing outside in the background. So since I do research the day before, I compile it into a video and if you want to discuss the lines, I have a Discord. The link is in the description. Uh, you can join the Discord and, and there's a great community. They discuss the lines all day long and uh, try to find the best plays uh, based off this research and their research. I don't charge for any of this. I don't think you should pay for something if you don't know if it's going to work yet or not. Uh, so if you do well with the information and you feel like giving back, uh, I have a cash app and a Venmo in the description and uh, you can donate and give back. It just helps motivate me and keep me going. And if you can, please like the video, uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't. And if you have a little bit of extra time, can you leave a comment? For the algorithm, it helps get the video out there. You can comment anything like a hello or bye. You can put an emoji. You can just write one word. It doesn't matter. Um, just any comment helps. And thank you to the people who, who do comment. And I'm also partnered with an app called Jock Market. They do player props and they also do trading players like stocks. I'm um, use promo code FINAROUND11 and they will match uh, your first deposit up to $100. And it's just... Uh, free 100 bucks with a, another app that has lines that you can compare it to with uh, other player prop apps that you have. And uh, for today, there's only two games going on. We have three teams that are pretty much solidified into their playoff spots. Um, possibly the Celtics can take the Bucks for the number one seed, but I'm not sure how much they care about that. We have one team, the Pelicans, who are trying to fight uh, to get out of the playing games. They're, that's still in reach for them. So you have one team that's really gonna try and you have other teams that I'm not so sure. Um, they're gonna put guys out there so they can stay in game shape, but they're they're not gonna be contesting you know, shots like they would if it was a playoff game or if they were fighting to get into the playoffs. Um, so I just have four picks for you guys, one from each team. Um, Giannis would be on a back-to-back. -back. I'm not sure if he plays it two games in a row, uh, especially with the playoffs coming up, and he's been dealing with an ankle injury. So my first pick is going to be for the team that is trying to win. It's Brandon Ingram. Uh, Denver, over the past two weeks, has given up the most points, uh, the 10th most rebounds, and the 5th most assists to the small forward position. And Brandon Ingram has been playing well. He's averaging 26.5 points, 5 rebounds, and 7.5 and assists over his last 10 games. Uh, so I expect the Pelicans as a team to, to try to play hard and a, as best as they can. So there's Brandon Ingram, um, but you can check the lines on the other guys. And if you see one that's low enough on like someone like Trey Murphy or C.J. McCollum, the, they might be a good play. Second pick is going to be Michael Porter Jr. The Pelicans over the last two, two weeks are actually giving up the least amount of points to the small four position and they're giving up the third least rebounds. So um, you have, a, like I said, you have a team who's solidified in their playoff spot. I'm not sure how hard Michael Porter Jr. is going to you know, push. He's a streaky guy. The Pelicans are going to try to defend him as hard as they can. Over his last 10 games, he's averaging 17.5 points and 5.5 and rebounds. Uh, so uh, tough matchup for him. So take a look at his lines and possibly unders for points and rebounds. Third pick, I'm going with Bobby Portis. This is especially if Giannis uh, is out. Over the last two weeks, the Celtics are giving up the second most rebounds to the power forward position. And over his last 10 games, Bobby Portis is averaging 14 and a half points and almost nine rebounds. So even when Giannis is on the court, he's still getting around nine rebounds. So if, if Giannis uh, is out, definitely look at Bobby Portis and uh, Guys who perform very well with Giannis out are also uh, Brooke Lopez uh, with points and rebounds. But I'm not sure how many of these starters are going to be resting on a back-to-back -back with the playoffs uh, a week and a half away. Uh, and, and the fourth picks can be Marcus Smart up against the Bucks. The Bucks have kind of toned it down with their defense over the past two weeks. They're giving up the fourth most points to the point guard position, and Marcus Smart is averaging... 11.2 uh, points so nothing crazy uh, if he gets a line at like ten and a half or nine and a half uh, that'll be a good spot to take an over 
So those are four picks. Uh, not not too many games, obviously. Uh, not a big slate. Uh, it might, might be a day to uh, fade completely, to be honest. It's going to be more tempting to look at guys who are like Jason Tatum and Jalen Brown and Giannis and, and take their unders um, because if it's you know automatically a blowout, you know they're going to sit. They're not going to try. Um, and so just take a look at PRAs if they're really high for these guys. It, it might be a good time to start taking unders because uh, they're just going out there. They're going to run their offense. They're going to get some shots up. Uh, but especially on the defensive end, they're, they're just not going to care. And that showed with the Celtics versus the Wizards. The Celtics just kind of let the Wizards do whatever they wanted, and they scored a ton. So that's my four picks. I think that's the least amount I've, I've done <laughs> in a while. So um, I hope you guys are doing well. Uh, God bless you. I do have an opening day video um, that's, that's going to be out as well. Uh, so I'm doing two videos for the first time and we will see how that goes. So God bless. It's fun around. My name is Jordan. Bye.